All right, everyone, welcome back to another live stream. Today, we're gonna play some Splatoon 2. Hopefully, you're all excited. King Monty, how's it going? Zebra, welcome back. Corey, welcome back. Hopefully, you all had a good Wednesday. It was Wednesday. Hopefully, you all had a wonderful Wednesday. Also, I am gonna try the, um, the P90 or the hero shot. Just to see how bad I am at it. Ordinary Kid, welcome back. Kid Perfect. Savage Nublet. Ashley, welcome back. Mr. Toast. Hopefully you all had good uh, Wednesdays. Cindy, welcome back. Evie, welcome back. Hopefully your Wednesdays were good. <laughs> good luck with that? Yeah, thanks. Uh, I'm gonna need it. I'm definitely gonna need it. I'm gonna switch back immediately. Just wait. Also, yeah, Corey, in the description below, I do have two straw polls for, uh, I'm just interested, like, what people are gonna get, um, Sonic, no, Team Sonic Racing and Crash Team Racing. Like, what people are probably gonna get those on, uh, like, which console? I'm probably gonna get them on Switch, but I just wanna gauge, like, what everyone else is gonna do. Super Mario Games, welcome back. Goldmaster, welcome back. You ordered a new VR today. And you'll get it from uh, now till... Oh, you ordered it today. Yeah, you'll get it soon. That's pretty cool. Uh, what VR is it? <laughs> Insidious, welcome back. You're getting it for the N64. Nice. That'll be fun. I'm sure the online is going to be uh, working 100%. Jurgen, welcome back. Josh, welcome back. Shadow, welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. Oh, PlayStation, it's the only thing you, uh, you use daily. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of VRs out there, so I just thought I'd ask. Actually, you're on my team. No friendly fire, but it's possible. Don't worry. I kind of read the don't worry as, like, you'll find another way. Alright, I gotta, like, remember how to aim. And not get sniped. Nope, nope. Alright, well, I tried. Amber, how's it going? Welcome back. <clears throat> oh yeah, Josh, don't worry, uh, you don't... Nobody has to really join or anything. I got one kill. That was a revenge kill, too. But good luck playing uh, some Cuphead. Man, that game was both... Not really aggravating, but it was a lot of fun to eventually succeed at it. Goldmaster, people think something's wrong with you if you would pick PS VR over PC VR. I mean, there's probably nothing wrong with you. It's just you could do a lot more with uh, a VR on on computer than you can on PlayStation. But I have no idea, like, what more you may or may not want to do. But I mean, it's completely up to you. I don't really know what use like I don't really know too much about VR Amber your day was great you passed all your finals and finished school well congratulations hopefully they weren't uh, too stressful or anything I didn't even have like a second I got one. I'm good. <laughs> Goldmaster, they think about tracking the game's microtransactions? I mean, I don't know if that has anything to do with it. That's... I mean, it's... The free will of anyone to buy stuff online, I guess. 
But I mean, uh, computers are probably always going to be the most advanced thing to use for something like VR or anything than like a console. You can't really upgrade a console as, as uh, well as you can a PC. Not all games on PlayStation have microtransactions? I don't know if microtransactions has anything to do with this, so I'm talking about just VR in general. Any game can have microtransactions, I don't think that matters. If you're into them, by all means, go ahead and buy some microtransactions. If you're not, then uh, you probably don't care about them. Also, I think it logged my account off again. I would be surprised. I mean, I assume... <laughs> I assume the worst in a lot of things, but I don't... I don't really care about microtransactions. I imagine they're everywhere. Like, by default, anything you could buy and pay money for. That seems to be the world nowadays. It did log me off again. Why, game? I mean, YouTube. Why would you do this? As soon as it hits 12. There we go. Okay. Yeah, Goldmaster, if microtransactions don't affect you, then... I mean, that... That is not really the point we're talking about. I thought we were talking about VR. I mean, it's not wrong to get VR on any console you want to get VR on. That's completely up to you. But, uh, I have no idea why people would think it'd be wrong to get it on anything they would want it to be on. Joshua, welcome back. Roar, welcome back. Were I off the grid? Like the internet? Uh, I don't think anything happened. Microtransactions from VR games? Yeah, but we're not talking about the microtransactions from... Well, at least I wasn't referring to microtransactions from VR games. I'm talking about VR in general. Jasmine, welcome back. Link, welcome back. Hopefully you both had wonderful Wednesdays. Like, if, if you're trying to say that, um, it's better to get it for some other console because there's less microtransactions, then that would be something to talk about, but, I mean, I don't really follow microtransactions, I imagine everything has them, and, uh, again, they shouldn't really matter if you don't like them, don't get them. But I mean, if anyone's going around saying that someone's wrong for getting VR for, like, PlayStation instead of PC, then, I mean, they are obviously concerned with the wrong people. Oh, and actually, there's the monitor in front of me. There's the, uh, YouTube everything to the right of me, and then to the right of that, there's OBS. So that is a total of three. Although I hardly look at the one that is, uh, OBS. Yeah, Eevee, unfortunately, uh, were they Joy-Cons? Yeah, Joy-Cons seem to have an issue where they will eventually drift after a while. I feel like I've heard so much of this happening. Although I don't really use them, so I can't really speak about it. Although I did have something happen with my Pro Controller. But I do have multiple ones of those. Yeah, Jasmine, it is May 9th for me, so I have less than 24 hours. In uh, which I can say I am a, a quarter of a century old. I'm not used to the sensitivity. I mean, technically, there's a fourth monitor over to the left. But that is, uh, like a test bench kind of thing. Not really anything I usually use. 
Sparkle, welcome back. Hopefully, had a pretty awesome Wednesday. No, I turned 26 uh, May 10th. I'm not really sure, like, the actual time, but... I mean, it's already uh, halfway to May 10th in Japan, but... I guess I should go with Eastern Standard Time. What a shot. I didn't even see what happened. Happy early birthday. Well, Jasmine, thank you. It is, uh, again, pretty close. Yeah, I could say a quarter of a century plus one, but again, I, that doesn't roll off the tongue as well. Yeah, it kind of seems like a lot of issues happen with Joy-Cons eventually. Maybe it's just that the joysticks like different than a lot of regular joysticks. What happened with my Pro Controller? I think it started drifting or something. It was, unfortunately, the Xenoblade Chronicles 2-1. But, uh, I think it was drifting or something. That was like a year ago, I think. Jake, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. I'm doing pretty well. Can't complain. Uh... Yeah, I mean, work. Streaming. Detective Pikachu's in a couple days. That's pretty exciting. Just trying to think of, like, things that are different. <laughs> Nintendo fan, welcome to the stream. Do I play Splatoon often? Usually, uh, once or twice? No, maybe two to three times a week? I do have a schedule, which could better explain when I do play Splatoon 2. It is at LunarComplex.com. But I'd say it's pretty often. Uh, this Mario Kart 8 Deluxe and Smash are probably the most often ones. Insidious, your neon yellow has, uh, yet to drift. Well, that's good. Although, have you used it a lot? Oh, Cindy, you got your Joy-Cons back from Nintendo, so they did fix the drift. They probably just replaced the, uh, the actual component in the Joy-Con. Like, if I ever... Maybe I should buy... If they sell the, uh, Pro Controller joysticks themselves, I should probably replace mine. Oh, and it's the gray ones that you have drift. Yeah, the ones you probably got with the console. Yeah, Eevee, I'm not sure if it... Uh, if they start drifting more because, like, more pressure is on the Joy-Con after a while, but... I mean, it seems like it eventually happens to everybody, unfortunately. Do I play Splatoon Friend Rooms? Uh, if you mean, like, the private battles, I think is what they're called, then that is pretty much all I do. And that, and with, uh, I guess Salmon Run's kind of the same with friend, uh, runes. But the only other thing I usually will do is, uh, the Splatfest. Where'd you go? I was definitely sure I was going to get one of you, but two? Two for one deal? I'll take that. I'm dead. Or not.
Oh, Durgeon, you have an actual button that just doesn't work? I'm pretty sure with my other Pro Controller, it's Drift. Like, I can't actually remember. I don't think it was, like, a button malfunction or anything. And yeah, I wonder if they did fix it with, like, a uh, future Joy-Con, but I don't really know how I would tell. Yeah, Nintendo fan, if you have any Joy-Cons that are, um, broken, you should be able to send them in for repair. I can't believe I aimed that. Joker, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. Have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, that was close. Cameron, you want to buy a Pro Controller, but you don't know which to get? Like, design-wise? They have a lot of designs out now. Before, it was just, like, the one. Amir, welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday as well. Although I will say for, as, as far as the Joy-Con go, like the buttons themselves, they're not really, they're like, they're like the clicky buttons. I don't know if I like that. I, th I think I like Pro Controller and pretty much regular console controller buttons that are like squishier. It's like the first DS that had clicky buttons and then the DS Lite, I think, had soft buttons. And Joker, I apologize, but I'm gonna just... I'm not gonna search through the, uh, friends list. Yeah, Jurgen, it's probably easier to aim with lower sensitivity, but I always go max with uh, games. Eventually, the best thing to do is get to max sensitivity. If you can control that, you that's the best you could play the game at. Although, with this game, it, this game has dead zone issues, so I'm not really sure what to do for this game, but I'm going to leave it at max. RMG, how's it going? Welcome back. I think you've been here before. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. And again, I'm probably just going to have to get used to the sensitivity. I'll probably change before that anyway. I'm just changing it up a bit. It's a fun gun to use. Donovan, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. Change to the charger? Oh, I would never. Yeah, see, I, I kind of don't play motion controls. I never liked motion. So I'm kind of stuck with probably the worst, which is just the actual joysticks. But I would definitely prioritize just having fun, and I don't want to use motion controls. <laughs> Donovan, I'm doing pretty well. Can't complain. Same old, same old. Although, Detective Pikachu is getting closer, so that's nice.
What level? I don't even know. I don't I don't level in this game. I think level 30 something. Level 40. I did make it to level 40, right? I can't I can't even remember. Yeah, if you want to play this game, like, the best you can, definitely go for motion controls. I just assume that is the way to go. But, uh, I don't like motion, so I'm gonna skip out on that. I don't plan to play this game competitively anyway. What is my favorite weapon? The one I'm using. The P90. Or in this game, the Hero Shot. But I usually main the Octo Brush. Since I don't use motion controls, that's probably the best advantage I'm going to get using that weapon. Yeah, Jurgen, I'm not really a sniper, though. I mean, I just go with the assault rifles, usually. Cringe Ryan, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. I thought you were about to say, why did I unfriend you, but someone else did. Uh oh. Oh okay, yeah, Ryan, I'll be able to, uh, just after the matches I usually check. Honestly, it's just muscle memory now. I'm probably gonna switch to the brush. Or not. Maybe not. Maybe I'll try and stick it out a little bit. Well, Jurgen, I've tried a lot of other weapons. I don't really like them, so I'm probably not going to use them. How many joins is that? One's got to go. Persona, you have been chosen. Like, charge weapons, I can't stand waiting. Snipers, those are charge weapons because they didn't want to make them overpowered in this game is the only thing I can assume. Like, you can't fire and then reload. Uh... And a lot of other weapons just seem like shotgun-type weapons. What is my favorite game ever? For Nintendo, it's Super Mario 64, but in general, I don't know if I could really answer that. There's a lot of good games out there. I know one of my favorites of all time I'll be playing later this weekend. Uh, that's Ratchet & Clank. If it works, it should. I hope it does. It's gonna be on an actual PS2. So we'll see how that goes. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I definitely got a little lucky there, not being aimed at. And where else it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a good Wednesday. Nintendo fan, you still play Animal Crossing on your Nintendo 3DS? Is it fun? I remember playing, uh, what was it? New Leaf? I cannot wait for the... I really hope we can get a release date soon for it. That was pretty punishable. That's Reggie's favorite game. On his favorite system. Is that his favorite system? Maybe that's the new Nintendo 3DS.
I keep thinking that's my ult for my brush, it's not. <laughs> Oh, there's an amiibo update for Animal Crossing on 3DS? I tried to get away. It didn't work. Oh, Jurgen, I wasn't even aware that the P90 was, like, high on the tier list. Come on, how's it going? Welcome back. Yes, I'm just... Usually, every once in a while, I'll switch back to the P90. And then switch right back to my brush. Which I'm about to do. <laughs> Oh, you get Splatoon items in Animal Crossing? That's pretty interesting. Oh, you know what? It does say my level right there. Back to the brush. Best weapon in the game. For me. Oh yeah, Cindy, I did notice you're uh, one star. Congratulations. I didn't know if that was something that may have happened a long time ago and I just didn't notice, but I didn't want to say anything. <laughs> Eevee, you don't trust yourself with a 3DS? Oh, like you feel like you might break it? Epic Games said Season 9 coming out tomorrow. Uh, for what? Like, what game? I can assume greatly what the game is, but, I mean, Epic Games, as the name suggests, has many games. Is that... yeah. Okay, that's 4v4. Although, you know, that is pretty close to just kind of... It being Rocket League, except they're on season 10, so I think. Pretty sure. Gonna go with yes. Oh yeah, Ryan, like Rocket League, this game level-wise, uh, I don't think it has anything to do with some player skill. Do I like to play Super Mario Maker? I don't think I've ever played Super Mario Maker. Always wanted to. Big fan of Carl Sagan 42. And uh, I cannot wait for um, Mario Maker 2. Because I never wanted to buy a Wii U. I thought they were um, pretty bad. Not really a good use of my money. And so I'm very excited that we're going to get that soon-ish for the, uh, the Switch. Because I really want to get invested in that game. Learn all the secrets. Oh, what a read. <laughs> yeah, and more season nine coming out for Fortnite. Well, if you're into Fortnite, there you go. Oh, no yellow team. 
We can't let Waluigi win. How did that not, like, hit you? Were you even damaged by that? Alright. Also, yeah, in hindsight, I'm so glad I never bought the Wii U because they're just re-releasing all the games out for this console anyway, so... I mean... What a move by Nintendo. Ashley, you're glad you didn't make the mistake of not requesting the weekend off before one of your for one of your exams on Monday. So wait, you did or didn't uh, request off? What happened? The double negatives kind of throw me off there. Oh, you did request off. Okay. Like, you needed to for the exam that you were going to have Monday? How did that not do enough damage? Mario fan, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. You know what's up? Just uh, patiently waiting for Detective Pikachu. How much damage does a weapon have? I have no idea. In Splatoon 2, I have absolutely no idea. I'd have to like look it up. Amber, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I imagine it has a certain number of damage. And that's probably modified by, like, some sort of ability things that you could have on, like, armor. That sounds right. Oh, you know what? They have bars. They have, like, a damage, a range, and a fire rate bar. Is that the three bars they have? Also, we'll probably move on to Rainmaker. <clears throat> Every player has 100 HP. Is that a base? Can that be modified at all? Han Rower, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. What is my favorite Splatoon game mode? Uh, Turf War. I'm just fine with that. I don't really care too much about, like, Rainmaker, or Splat Zones, or Tower Control, or any of that. Mainly because you get to go around the entire map, and it's a lot of fun. Second would probably be, uh, Clan Blitz. Just because, again, you get to go around the map, and that's... It's a lot of fun. Also, please try and ready up as soon as possible. Thank you. Well, Nintendo fan, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, actually, you need the time off to uh, study. Hopefully you're ready for uh, all your exams. <clears throat> Oh, 
Oh, you ran that way. Oh, actually, it, all, it wasn't already written on, like, paper that they were going to cover your ship. It was just hearsay. Got to make sure it's written. Loading rabbit, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. Where did they go? Where's the other team? Oh, there they are. Huh. Was that just really good timing on our part? Yeah, actually, it's kind of lame that they didn't really honor the first request. What can you do? Gotta make sure it's official. So does that mean you're gonna have to work during that shift? Or is there like someone else who's gonna have to take that over? Oh yeah, Jurgen, I imagine if, uh, for example, if I were going to be very competitive with this game and decide and try and do the absolute best you could, I would definitely follow whatever the meta is. If that's working, then I mean, that's probably the way to go. What is my favorite Mario game? Super Mario 64. It is the best. Not an opinion. Nope. For me, it is fact. I'm dead. Oh, there's a wall there. Alright. I might eventually... Take some time to look at the screen. I'm dead. <laughs> I wasn't, I probably didn't even have enough time to like look up in this game. Not with joysticks. Yeah, Floating Rabbit, I've heard a lot of good things about the Paper Mario series. I never really played it. I played a lot of other RPG games that were in a different, like, IP. Like, not Mario-based. I usually just play, like, platforming games uh, from Mario. Or, like, kart racing or uh, party games. There's another one of those walls.
Amir, speaking of Super Mario 3D World, did we just get like a port already? That'd be great. 3D Land was amazing. I've played very little of 3D World, but what I played was pretty awesome. Like, I think I'd be pretty, uh, I mean, I would still not, uh, be happy about them still not having N64 games on the Switch, but I think I'd be pretty content if that was, like, one of the reveals for E3 or whatever. Someone's still over there. Oh, they're behind it. Okay. This way is even better, isn't it? Amir, if a company bought my game idea and wanted me to be lead production with whatever I want my salary to be, would I take that chance? No. I don't want them to own my ideas. If it's like a throwaway title I don't care about, or a throwaway idea of a game I don't care about, maybe, but uh, for like my main projects, absolutely not. There'd have to be some sort of contract saying that I get to still own my ideas, because I'm not gonna just sell those. Like, I still can't believe Notch decided to sell Minecraft. I mean, that's just... What are you doing? <laughs> Cindy couldn't escape a second time. And Floating Rabbit? No, I don't think I've ever played a... Uh, Nintendo related flash game before yeah insidious someone sold not just Rocket League but I mean what other thing did psionics do they did a couple things but yeah I mean there's that yeah Amir exactly like if you have a good idea like, I'm sure it'd be great, you know, to have a company buy that and then give you money to work on it and all the resources, but it's like, that's just still, they could ruin it. <clears throat> yeah, Insidious, I'm, I'm pretty sure Sonics has more games, right? They gotta have at least something. Does that mean we'll get Rocket League Battle Royale? Probably. You just wait for it. Justin, you're gonna hold off on Team Sonic Racing? You really wanna go see uh, Detective Pikachu? Yeah, Detective Pikachu's hopefully gonna be an awesome movie. And Super Mario Maker 2 is probably a must-get game. 
Also, if anyone wasn't here before in the beginning of the stream, I do have two straw polls in the description. Uh, just kind of asking, like, what console do you plan to get, uh... Is it Team Sonic Racing and then Crash Team Racing? Whatever those two titles are. Because I think I'm going to just end up getting them for the Switch, but I'm just curious... What other consoles people are going to get them for. Don't worry, team. I got this. Well, I got much further than I thought. They just disappeared. What? Were they on the other team? That was strange. You only get Super Mario Maker 2 if it doesn't require the Nintendo services online. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's gonna require it, but... I mean, that's just, unfortunately, something we have to accept. Hey, at least Nintendo waited this long. And it's much cheaper than, like, Sony and Xbox, but... We probably get much less from it. <laughs> Aren't you literally a Mario fan? I gotta admit, there's some logic in that statement. What is the most worst movie... Ever the emoji movie, the Minecraft movie. There's a Minecraft movie? Wait, what? And the Sonic movie still has a chance. They're redesigning Sonic, so that's probably already gonna make it better than a lot of things. Evie, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. And Donovan, you'll be getting it for both. Probably should have made both an option. I don't think that is. Oh well, maybe it is. Like, I could see games with story being a movie more so than a sandbox game. Like, Minecraft, that's just... I, I don't even know if I could get, like, on board with that at all. Fantastic, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. By the way, that dragon. <laughs> I saw your, um... Your attempt at uh, Grim Matchstick, and I think it's Matchstick, right? The one boss in Cuphead. I'm glad I'm not the only one who had so much issue with that boss. It was a great feeling afterward, let me tell you. <laughs> Sorry to bring up anything that may be uh, terrible. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, that, man, that boss. It takes a while to get used to. How did I kill people? What? Goris, I didn't even notice that you went down the ramp. What am I talking about? I beat the dragon in one try? I will say, after the three hour video of failing that dragon and then waiting a day coming back, then I beat it first try. Oh no, it was like a weekend. It was multiple days, I didn't even touch video games. Still, I spent like three hours on it. I just needed to take a break, relax, go to a campfire, not think about video games. Wait, Ghost, are you asking me if I'm considering getting Sonic Team... No, Team Sonic Racing on another console? No, oh, I'm just alive? I'm dead. Wait, fantastic. Have you not beat uh, Cuphead?
And what do I like Yu-Gi-Oh or do I like you go Yu-Gi-Oh 5D? Uh I like the TCG. Is that an option? He beat the dragon and stuff. Well, I will say that that was probably the worst part of the game for me. Everything else after that seemed much easier, even like, like everything. Every single thing after that. I would say it gets better. Isle 3 or whatever it is. The third world. Definitely worth it. Although there may be a little bit of a tricky section toward the very end of the game, but... You just gotta get used to it. Yeah, Donovan, I, I think... By default, I'll probably get the Sonic Racing game and the Crash Racing game on Switch. Just because it'd be easier for me to set it up. PlayStation 4, I gotta worry about changing inputs and then worrying about, like... Am I allowed to stream this part of the game or is it gonna do anything weird or something like that? And then Xbox, I just use that as a 4K player, so... Floating Rabbit, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Jack, welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. And Kitten, welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday as well. I'm doing pretty well. Can't complain. Work was pretty normal. Uh, I did take off the uh, Friday and Saturday, though, so... Won't have to... I'll have uh, tomorrow to work and then... Uh, and then a four-day weekend. So that'd be pretty nice. What do I think about the new Mario Maker 2? Well, I don't have any experience playing the first one because I never owned a Wii U, but, uh... I mean, it looks good. Looks like it's going to be the second one, but with, uh... Just a lot more stuff. And I understand ramps are new, but again, I've not played the, uh... The first one, so I'm not really sure what some of the key differences are. And I have no idea if it's going to uh, be the last one. I imagine if Nintendo wants to keep making more money, like a company usually does, they'll probably make a third one. <laughs> Go risk Mario Maker physically hurt you? Do you want to talk about it? I'm sure I'm probably going to even get more upset about Mario Maker than any game I've played so far. Including Cuphead. You don't want to talk about it. Okay, you don't want to warn us of anything? All right, we'll probably do one more Rainmaker and then move on to the uh, Splat Zones, I think, is next. <laughs> Who needs Mario Maker 2 when you have the ultimate stage builder? Yeah, but... But, but really? Oh, did Super Mario Maker 1 have, like, any of the coin run stuff that, uh, that the new Super Mario the Wii U Deluxe game had? 
Because, I mean, that was a lot of fun to do. I wonder if there's going to be a way to, like, make modes like that in the game. Fantastic, you don't think so? Oh, it didn't have coin run challenges. It did have levels made by... Oh, but it did have levels made by the official Nintendo staff. Yeah, but those aren't custom levels. Yeah, you could go for the eight keys or red coins or whatever they're called. Go for the one key. And I know you can make running levels. It was just fun to, like, do some of the ones in the new Super Mario Brothers U thing. Whatever game. What a read. <laughs> oh no. I need backup. What am I doing? Oh, I should have charged that sooner. Whoops, that's not the right button. There we go. And where again, I never played uh, Super Mario Maker, so I have no idea. Oh, my mistake. Uh, Mario Michael. Can't say that I played a game like that. Oh, there's someone down there. Yeah, and how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. Also, Justin, I would really love, like, uh, a, um... Oh, I guess you did say 3D classic Sonic-style game that's open-world collection. Yeah, there's the Sonic World thing, or Sonic something that... That is, like, an unofficial Sonic game or something that looks really cool. Something like that would be a lot of fun. Oh, goes the costumes? I know some of the costumes. Uh, again, I've seen a lot of Mario Maker being played. A lot of it. Hours upon hours. You had a umbrella. Yeah, I think it was called Sonic Utopia. Had a really cool remixed uh, song that was uh, a little difficult to find because, again, I don't think it was anything like official. But it was like a really, really open 3D level of like Green Hill Zone and you just run somewhere toward the other side of the world. Had really cool uh, slopes and whatnot. Even the running sound by like Sonic was pretty satisfying. Oh, I thought I got all of you.
Insidious, the rush levels are the running parkour levels, right? Those seem pretty cool. Like, where you also have to do uh, shell jumps and everything and uh, grab power blocks and, like, make sure you time those correctly and etc. Can't believe it's already been an hour. I saved my team? Well, there you go, team. Uh, per Jurgen, I saved you. How about that? I was just doing what I do best. Try and spam the brush. But, like, goodly. I'll paint every single thing out there. Yeah, Insidious, I'm not really sure what you mean by beat the super mushroom. Is that like a boss? <laughs> and more, what is my favorite Go cartoon on Cartoon Nickelodeon? Uh... Uh... I mean, that's a good question. I don't really know. Oh, all my teammates were dead and the Rainmaker was very close to get a better score than ours? What if I did know all of that? I actually did. Well, actually, I might be able to try the s'mores, uh, frap. But, then I won't be getting the, uh, mint chocolate thing that I can ask for. Not the midnight mint mocha frappuccino, but I'm sure they can come up with something. Because I have still yet to get my free and drink at Starbucks, and I plan to do that tomorrow. What is my favorite go-to cartoon on Cartoon Network? Uh... Honestly, for Nickelodeon, it's either Spongebob or Drake and, Drake and Josh. But for Cartoon Network... Uh... Ed and Eddie slash Teen Titans, maybe? Like, if I just had to... If I just wanted to leave something on in the background? I prefer The Office from uh, Comedy Central, I think, but... If we're talking about Cartoon Network, probably one of those two. They also have a chocolate cookie crumb... Oh, crumble? One that tastes like Oreos. That sounds pretty good. But I gotta choose wisely. I mean, I really do like the chocolate mint things they can make. The Office is the best. It really is one of the best. I can always go back and watch more of The Office. Any episode in this good. God, how many missiles are there? Oh, do they all have the special? One more shot. That's all I needed. Well, 
Well, Insidious, it was a good draw. Yeah, Jurgen, I'm, I'm sure missiles are probably uh, pretty good for this uh, this mode. Also, this stage in particular, where there's only one zone. Justin, the office is great because not only is it just funny comedy, but the interactions between the characters and like just even the feelings are uh, pretty good. Like, there's a good amount of feeling from that show. Oh, missiles are top tier now? Was there anything that changed? Man, so far this is a pretty good fight. That was a, a good move to do. Who's my favorite character from The Office? It's either Dwight or Jim. Probably. I mean, Michael's another good one. It's got to be one of those three. And I guess Dwight kind of interacts with both of them. Not really a lot of, like, interactions between, like, Jim and Michael, but... I don't know, like, Dwight alone. Still funny, but gotta have either Michael or Jim. Well, Han, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I guess the banter between Dwight and Jim probably some of my, like, favorite moments. Like, all the pranks that they pull on each other. It's just, they're, they're so well done. Everybody dead. Or half of everybody dead. On their team. Close. Second later, I would have been dead.
Oh, I did get you. I did get two. <clears throat> that was looking like a team kill. But Cindy, you got me. It was close. No escape from the Roomba army. Wait, Curtis, they used a clip from the office about the CPR thing? That's pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's all you need to watch, and you're uh, you're certified immediately after watching that uh, that video clip. Oh, you're too far. I can't. Maybe I helped a little bit. Really, it took two more swings? I stopped after the one and thought I was just, that was it. Thought I would just continue my day covering the other sections of the zone, but nope. Had to go for a second, then dead. Oh no, not the Roombas again. Jody, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a uh, wonderful Wednesday. Wait, Justin, have you not seen The Office or Drake and Josh? Is that what's going on? Accept my fate. <laughs> Good one, Ashley. Oh, yeah, Justin, I'd say Drake and Josh even still applies to, like today. Like, I'd say it still holds up, at least what I've seen from it. And in the past, like, 10 years, I've probably seen maybe like 10 to 15 episodes again. I'd say it definitely still holds up. Have I seen New Girl or uh, Brooklyn Nine-Nine? I've seen New Girl. There's a lot of funny actors on that show. <laughs> but yeah, Drake and Josh would highly recommend. I think all of it's on like Hulu or something.
What are we doing, Splat Zone, still? We'll do a couple more. I'm not sure how many seasons Drake and Josh is, but I'm sure probably getting through the office would take a lot longer. Oh yeah, Winston and Schmidt are really funny. Like, Schmidt's probably one of the funniest characters. <laughs> just, the way he reacts to, like, everything is just, it's a very good character that they put together in that show. I need to go back and watch that show if I can. Just, like, leave it on in the background. And I think I've seen the finale, but I don't remember if I... I'd have to rewatch it again. Like, I remember taking a break from it and coming back to it, I think, multiple times. Also, again, try and ready up as soon as possible. Just want to make sure we try not to waste all of the time. Is there a game that I actually hate a lot? Uh... Not really. I mean... Usually if there's a game I don't like to play, I'm just... Not really gonna... Care about it. Because hate would imply a sort of caring, right? There's gotta be, like, something close to that in a video game. Ashley, how did you know? Yeah, Justin, if I if I try and think about it, I think they did a lot of close, closing on some characters. But uh, I'd have to rewatch it again. A game I would actually hate. I really don't think there is something like that. I mean, RuneScape became pay to win, but that just makes me not really care about the game anymore than, like, hate it. And again, if a, if a game is, like, terrible, I'm just not going to care about it. I'm not really going to hate it. Just gonna be like, yeah, that exists. Uh, all right then, and then kind of move on. Really? I was still in range. Are you kidding me? Daisy, the video game. See, I don't have to hate, like, or dislike that because it just doesn't exist. So I'm, I'm good. We're gonna keep it that way. Gummy, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. Why are there just bombs and everything everywhere that is going to explode? Including me. There I go. If it doesn't exist, how did you see me playing with a flower? That has never happened. You know, I think 
maybe one of the games I would eventually or maybe like dislike a lot or hate would be like maybe mobile games where they're just poorly designed and you just like pay to win everything maybe something like that but again I just don't care about them it's like one of the uh, there's like a uh, what is it um, a Rocket League ripoff game that's on mobile and you pay for boosts <laughs> Honestly, that's just funny, but, like, I just don't really care. <laughs> Justin, thoughts on what? What is that? Oh, Donovan, what are the games that you don't like? There we go. Finally got someone. That was, like, the best technique. Yeah, I'm not sure of the penguin thing. But yeah, Jurgen, there's a lot of formulas to, like, addicting mobile games and, like, generic genres. Like, I'm sure Clash of Clans has many clones. Uh, Bejeweled. Isn't that pretty much what Candy Crush is? Pretty much just, like, Bejeweled, but extra and themed, I guess. Every game that comes out is Candy Crush. <laughs> I mean, it's a good formula. I don't really care about that style game, but... I mean, I'm sure a lot of people do, because there's a lot of people who are playing it. Also, we're going to move on to um, Tower Control. Donovan, uh, Mega Man X6, and Fire Emblem Echoes. Oh, you like these games, but, uh, they put a lot of things that you didn't like in them. Okay, so they kind of, like, made you just not feel great about them. Candy Crush is Discount Tetris? Well, it's Bejeweled, right? Like, that's the style of puzzle. I'm not sure if it has a more proper name, but where you just move the columns and rows to match up the similar icons and then they go away and things happen or fall down. Oh yeah, actually the Roomba army. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, Brayden, did you just come back from uh, Endgame? I'm not going to fall for it that easily. But that, sure, I'll just stand there. So close. One more hit. Aquaman is DC, not Marvel. I'm sure people are just making jokes.
How did that get me? Really? Was that just on the edge? All right. I thought I was safe. <laughs> Ashley, my weakness. I would say that's not fair, but it's all my end. <laughs> Does Aquaman drown or suffocate? Girl, I was waiting for that. <laughs> well, that was just a warm up, so. Like every loss. Yeah, Jurgen, I don't know how I'm feeling about Smurf accounts. Like, I want to say there's nothing good that comes from somebody masking themselves as a weaker player. Alcaz, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome day. Like, I never really, I don't want to put anyone down who does that sort of thing, but I didn't really care about it back when I heard a lot of people doing that, and like when League of Legends started to become popular, and I'm sure it happened in CSGO a lot, but, but it is really annoying when now I'm trying to be competitive in Rocket League. Now I'm kind of getting like a little bit of what people were probably talking about all along. Pie or cake? Uh, I mean, pie is pretty good, but cake is probably leagues better. Also, yeah, Insidious, it's unfortunate, but I don't think there's anything that the game can do to stop anybody from joining another console. But what's good about that is I don't think you lose a whole lot of... Uh, Whatever the score ranking system is for your points for Rocket League or something. MMR, does that make sense? Is that the term? Where is the tower? There it is. And now, Kaz, no, I don't think I've ever streamed, uh... Okami HD. Um, I don't even think I've played the game before. There was two bombs there. Are you serious? That was a worthy death. Fanny, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully we had a pretty awesome Wednesday. Cola, how's it going? Welcome back. Wait, Link, does it does Splatoon not work on a uh, ranked-based system when you're playing online? It must do that. It's got to do that, right? I hope it's not based off of level or anything. Cause, I mean, they shouldn't factor in level at all. It means nothing. Compared to, like, skill.
Justin, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, Kami is made by the, the same people who made Bayonetta and DMC, really? Is that the wolf one? Laser beam of death. All right. It is the wolf one. I might check it out. I don't have any plans for it, though. But I have some friends who played it, and they uh, really enjoyed it. I think they had, I think, all of them. I know there's a couple out there. Oh, Link, I don't think it should be level-based at all. Again, levels don't mean anything. It just means how long you've played the game, not how good you are at it. When playing ranked, it doesn't matter. Someone could be better than someone after... Someone with, like, a hundred hours could potentially be better than someone who has, like, a thousand hours in the game. But I don't think games are ranked off of those kind of levels. At least that's not how it works in Rocket League and I want to say most games. It would kind of be terrible if it was level based. <laughs> I mean, I imagine eventually when everybody's max, it's just that can't. It's got to be like the letter grade based, right? Yeah, Link, you could be a, a higher level player means that somebody's been playing like, let's say level, to get to level 99 takes, I don't know, maybe like a thousand hours. Uh, I mean, it, it kind of, it's just time you spend in the game. You could say that that could logically line up with like a player being good at a game at a thousand hours but it's just that's just the time you spend playing the game that that means nothing for like how good someone is because not everybody is the same and learns the same it just tells you usually kind of how long you've played the game and cities have a good one thanks for stopping by Oh yeah, Alcaz, I'll definitely be streaming uh, DMC1. Hindsight, I'm glad I didn't stream 1 through 4 for 5. Uh, conveniently, I guess the Switch is getting PS2 games. So. But yeah, definitely. Uh, don't know when they're going to come out with DMC, but uh, it'll be updated on the schedule eventually. And Ryan, I do apologize, but I can't get to everybody in the chat, but have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, we'll do still some tower. But imagine, like, playing as long as someone else who's played, yet they are leagues above your skill level, but you always keep getting matched with them. That's not going to be fair. What you should do is base off of a sort of value that the more wins you get, the more chances you're going to get matched with somebody who has the same number of wins. Not like how long you played the game. Which is what most games do for ranking, because it's just that makes sense. And Jurgen, I'm sure some people who enjoy Splatoon 1 more 
probably have other reasons of enjoying it more than just nostalgia. Capcom said there's no plan for the physical copy. Yeah, I imagine they would never make a physical copy of a much older game. But that's fine for me. I already have a physical copy of DMC1 anyway. <laughs> but I mean, I wouldn't even really get a physical copy anymore. Uh, game? There you go. I don't know how I got up there. I tried to not go up the wall all the way, but it just did it. Oh yeah, Jurgen, I'm sure it has like a lot of faults to it and everything, but I mean just saying anybody who chooses it over Splatoon 2 is because of nostalgic, I don't know if that's necessarily true. I'm sure there's at least one person who enjoys Splatoon 1 just because they enjoy it. And maybe for other reasons than just because it's nostalgia based. Azura, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Wednesday. Oh yeah, Kukola, that's one of the things that, I mean... I wouldn't consider playing this game competitively because it's just Nintendo would have to treat it to a much higher standard than they do now. I mean, having having some things locally saved? Come on. You are Oreo Toast, by the way? Oh, like in the game. Okay. All right. Oh, I should have waited. But two could join. It was just one. Ashley, uh, chili or clam chowder? I'd say clam chowder is, like, a very small margin ahead of chili. But let's say, for example, I've, I've had, like, clam chowder for ten days in a row. I'd probably choose chili after that, if there was like an option. <laughs> Clam 
clam chili. <laughs> what would that... Is that kind of already what it is? Is that chowder? What is chowder? Other than a character. Yeah, Star is pretty much just prestige. I'm not sure what game did it first, but I know Call of Duty had a lot of prestige in it. Don't worry, other team. The tower is in good hands. You don't have to do anything. Like, throw bombs on this thing. Why would you do that? thought it was the other side. I can't believe I still got you, though. That was the end? I thought it went up like another level. Well, good job, team. We did it. We weren't blue, but they were, and how dare they? We were yellow. The color of Pikachu. Detective, coming out soon to a theater near you. <laughs> what would I do if the Statue of Liberty uh, got replaced with Daisy? Uh, I would... Uh, I'd be very concerned. <laughs> I don't know exactly what I would do. Now, if it said with a sign at the bottom saying for Lunar, I would have to change my name. <laughs> or for Joe. Yeah, I mean, I'd have to change my name. 100% sure. But then they could change the sign. <laughs> Daisy, the symbol of liberty. She doesn't exist, though. It would say Lunar Complex slash Lunar slash Joe. I'd have to change everything. Website, username, nickname for the user, my actual nickname. Liberty truly doesn't exist either. I mean, if that's also what Daisy is doesn't exist. Where was I going with this? <laughs> Change it to John Complex. Yeah, that's what I'll go by. Good old John Complex here. Live streaming some Splatoon 2. Free of daisies, though, so that's that's a plus. Oh, 
Oh no. I was missing every single time. Oh, I'm still alive. That was close. Oh, you know what? Why wouldn't I do that? Again, I thought I'd be safe down there. Oh, the shot went right over- are you kidding me, game? Oh, they actually took over the tower. There we go. Yeah, Jurgen, there's a couple moments where I thought I would have been clear of the bomb, but I wasn't. I thought I was just being bad at the game like usual. But did they buff the range or damage or... Does anybody know? Also, we'll do... We're going to start Clan Blitz. It's already almost been two hours. I don't understand. It's, it's felt like half an hour. Sorry, we can't disclose that information. They have patch notes, though, right? Oh, Ashley, did your school release the, uh, the class lists? Gotta wait for making the teams even. No one wants to play Clamblets. Go to for school, you get to go to the beach? What are you gonna do there? Outside, with sand and water. I guess I'll be 2v2. Once a year to go kayaking? Or kayaking at the beach? Don't you usually go kayaking like down a river? I don't understand how it works. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm probably wrong. Oh, it's like a bay. Okay. Corey, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by.
That was so close. <laughs> Please be one more clam somewhere over here. Oh, why did they do that? That should have gone back. Like, is there a chance that... Oh, should I return now? Is it going to be too late anyway? It's not going to be. I got to go back. Trying to throw the football at me? Does that do any damage? Alright, that should go back up. I should have went right for them. Would have been teleported right back here. No, that was so close. I don't know, someone was already on our side. can make that jump. <laughs> By all accounts, I should have died there. You talking about the jump over the water? Because you're right. I don't know how I made that. Not over yet. But we need a lot more clams. Uh, oh no, now it's kind of tight. Oh, it's 2v1? Oh, someone DC'd? Well, that makes sense. That would probably be why we started to win. I don't know why I went down there. <laughs> I just wanted to move somewhere. Down was uh, not a good idea. Oh, so you threw the football so it would be harder to aim for you? Oh. probably was deserved. I will say 2v2s though, they're pretty fun. 
There's plenty of uh, clams to go around. Oh no, like we're gonna have salmon run. I'm just gonna probably start a little uh, later. Usually, if there's salmon run and it's not splat fest, we'll probably always do salmon run. And I think there's at least a couple weapons in this time salmon run, this event salmon run, the salmon run event. There's there's weapons that I'm perfectly fine using. Yeah, Jurgen, I just <clears throat> kind of like going around the map and collecting things. But with 2v2, there's plenty to go around and collect. Oh, session. Yeah, salmon run session. That makes a lot more sense. Corey, thanks for the luck. Uh, we'll see what happens. <laughs> Hope you lose. You're talking to the other team, right? <laughs> Really? That missed? Anyone else see how close that was? That was so close, I can't believe it. What a start that would have been, too, if I could just aim properly. Thanks a lot, joysticks. Just someone there. I don't know where they went. I also just need one clam. There's gotta be just one. Oh, it would explode. There's the death. close calls.
What? Was that not on the thing? The game, what are you doing to me? I thought I saw it like it was on the barrier, right? I don't know what's going on anymore. And girls, do I believe in aliens? I mean, there's... I have no idea if there's a way to prove or disprove it, so I'm kind of... What would be, like, the third option? Well, that was close. Oh yeah, Goris, I imagine, I mean, there's, I mean, I imagine, like, there's gotta be something else out there that, you know, can, uh, that is, like, sentient or something, but, I mean, I'm kind of, uh, waiting to see what happens, and I'm sure there's maybe something out there, I just, I don't really think about it either way. That was definitely a miss, I saw that that time. There we go. Not to mention there's multiple galaxies. Well, there's billions of stars in each billions of galaxies, so, you know, the chance is probably pretty likely. But again, I... I can't really prove or disprove it. So I kind of really don't think about it. Oh yeah, Bridget, I'll be able to accept, uh... Did I not get a football? What? What is happening? Oh, I should go over there immediately. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, Jurgen, I doubt I have any, like, actual football slash soccer skills in real life. Again, I prefer to play video games. Kukola, I don't even know the, the meaning of the word. <laughs> Girls, you haven't completed Salmon Run training yet. So you don't know how to play it. Person who is oriented toward the success or failure of a practical line of action, thought, etc. A practical person? I guess it would depend on what you define success as, because as far as I'm concerned, I don't really care about, like, successful sort of stuff, I guess. Like, what does that mean? Like, I just do what I enjoy doing, what I've found that I enjoy doing. And that's, that's pretty much it. Like, I don't bother anybody. Nothing really bothers me. Just doing things to do things. And that's, that's me. And streaming. But I imagine there's, like, levels or different, like, degrees of that, maybe? I mean, if I was oriented toward the success or failure of a particular thing, line of action, something I could do, I'm pretty sure I'd probably be, like, streaming something else, depending on what, like, the definition of success would be. Because I'm sure there's other games that could get me, quote-unquote, popular, but it's, I mean, that's not what I'm really aiming for. Not really aiming for much of anything, really.
We need more Joes in this earth. Hopefully not in. I'm still alive. What have I done? Do we really need more of me? Look at what just happened. <laughs> How did you escape? That was... I made sure that you couldn't. <laughs> yeah, Kukola, uh, I'd be careful with what you say, I mean... No, uh, don't think too deeply in any controversial topics. We don't need to go down any sort of, like, pointless avenue. Oh, no. Can you just let me, like, throw the football into the, the barrier and then we get points, please? You know, to make it interesting. Alright, anybody got two clams? Going once, going twice? I'll pay top dollar. Or that. That works. Man, these Roombas. Where did they go? Yeah, Kukola, I mean, you can cite a clause or a rule number, but... I mean, there's also the rule. I can just make up whatever and it's deemed a rule. I think that'd be clause like 10 or something. I can't remember. I can make it 10. Oh, you went that way. See, that's so weird. I fired, it hit the ground, and then you ran into it after the fact. And that still did damage? Or was that just the terrible internet? Oh, you can't go that way. like three more clams that's it yep I figured that was gonna happen and Jordan I've I'm pretty sure like the first maybe not the first webcam stream like my legs have been visible before We were three off. But at least I'm matching. So 
That's that's a plus. All right, we'll do one more clan blitz and then maybe two more. Eventually, we're going to play Salmon Run. Eventually, it's going to load. One of these days. There you go, game. Take your time. Well, Durgeon, I'm not meaning like salmon run as if the salmon are running, but it's just the name of the thing. But, that, you know, there's a joke there somewhere. Also, you don't need legs to run. Refrigerators have figured it out. Somehow. They're on to us. Or we're on to them. They don't know yet. <laughs> they use the power of believing to run. Probably shouldn't have just jumped right out there. Oh well. Oh, one of you got away. There was two footballs, really? I can't believe it. It's unbelievable. Not possible. Couldn't have happened. Maria, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a wonderful Wednesday. Almost got by me. They still made it through with the football. I couldn't finish the mission. I'm sorry, team. Again, I should have just waited. Get them next time. I really needed that one? Can I not count? All right. Maybe the game can't count. Maybe it's wrong. There's the one clam I needed. Thank you. But it doesn't help me. Oh, wait. There we go.
Where are they getting these? What? They had three footballs? Someone selling these? Where can I find them? There we go. Totally worth it. Azura, I left you? I mean, I'm, I'm not really focusing on the team plays as much because we're not. It's it's kind of just randoms. I'm not really sure what team plays are. At least in this game. Over time. This is where we'll get them. Wait, what happened? I thought it stays overtime until a barrier is broken. Who knows how this game is played? Oh, we have to keep a football or else it just, we lose? Oh, I didn't realize you had to like keep a football alive. I thought it was until like a barrier is broken or something. We'll play one more clan blitz though and then we'll move on to a uh, run of the salmons. There's no meta? Uh. I mean, I'm sure there's something that most people use. But I mean, I'm not that familiar with the game. <laughs> Goris, you're the meta. There you go. Proof right there. I mean, I doubt Nintendo is good enough to make a game that is perfectly balanced. As all things should be, so I'm sure there's at least some meta that is like 1% better. You mean there's no foundation for a meta? Yeah, but there's weapons and abilities you can attach to your character, and I mean, that's there are differences between those, and meta would be whichever ones like most people use. At least as far as I understand it. Also, meta can, can even reference, like, how to play the game. I'm probably not playing the meta with uh, without motion controls. I imagine that's always going to be better. The game was programmed with, uh, something in mind. What is that? I'd have to look up that word. Although, regardless how the game is played, I mean, there are different abilities in guns, and some, there's gonna be probably a majority that are used, even if it's just by, like, a little bit. Again, it can even come down to the controller. They didn't make Joy-Con uh, or joysticks to be exactly the same as motion controls, and that alone could be a meta.
They're leaving us one? Oh, that's kind. Thanks, other team. Well. Oh, did we have a DC? Moving on to Salmon Run. Actually, you saw someone DC right in front of your eyes. Must have been terrifying. If I remember correctly, there's a bucket and like two weapons I enjoy. There's a bucket and I don't really care for the soda pop one, but this is not bad. Better than most. Georgian, if you're heading out, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I'm really not going to like that sniper. I think that that's one that just, it's like weak. You can, has a high fire rate. It's this one with the rails. That's what it's called. I think the name may have been right at the bottom left, but who looks at that? Big Tin Chu, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome day. Oh yeah, anyone's more than welcome to join. Uh, friend code's in the description below. Alright, where are some of the bosses at? I don't know what happened. Twenty-one out of twelve. It's not too bad. You really have to jump on it. All right.
Oh, come on. Do the attack thing. Come on. That was not worth it. even paying attention to the we didn't make the quota oh we were one off okay i thought we were doing fine and dandy i didn't even realize that well that's a number to pay attention to But again, regardless if you uh, if we won or not, please do not join again if you've played at least once already. It probably won't take long to get through anybody or everybody anyway, but just to make sure. Cola, do you plan to get the online service? If anyone has Amazon Prime, I think you can still... Is that... Was that a deal that expires? I think you're able to get something Nintendo Online free. Yeah, if anybody wants to join, feel free. That was enough time. want the third gun there that's what similar to the p90 andy maybe more similar to like the arrow spray cool cola you're protesting all right Actually, it was cloudy today and you loved it. Speaking of cloudy, it is, uh, there are some low clouds. Does that mean it was, like, cooled off today? Dead already. Yeah, Kukola, I imagine nobody really wants to pay for absolutely no change to the online um, quality, but I don't ever think it's going to go away. And I mean, I still haven't really paid for my own, so... I 
was pretty close on the quota. Oh yeah, Cindy, if you don't feel comfortable like taking apart a, a controller, I'm not sure if it voids anything, uh, but I mean, sending it in probably is the best thing to do. And yeah, Corey, I was debating whether or not if it would be worth it to go back, deposit, uh, deposit this thing, and then uh, return back. I was the bomb. Almost again. And why I don't usually ever play with the uh, the Joy-Con. They are not good. But I have to play it for um, arms and... Well, not have to, but for Pokemon and arms, I will use the Joy-Con. Ah, this is the weapon. Oh, and Mario Party. I almost forgot about that game. That game that had so much potential and just... They Wii U'd it. Shoot far enough? Alright, well. And more, what is my favorite Joy Con color? I have the light blue ones. Those are pretty cool. But I mean, I don't really use them enough to really care too much about like what color they are. The yellow ones do seem kind of cool, because it's like, isn't it, uh, like, fluorescent color? And yeah, Corey, uh, Persona is you. I think you mentioned that before. It's close to the lab coat. Don't they also have, like, a darker red color Joy-Con? What was that from? Because I know they have, like, a brighter red one. But that's not the one I'm talking about. Well, girls, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. The 
The Odyssey ones, that's right. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And you can't get those separate, can you? Cindy, your favorite ones are the uh, the Splatoon ones. That's just the green and pink ones. Yes, it is the green and pink. Do they make the other pairs for those? So you could have like two green ones and two pink ones? Mind, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hope we had a wonderful Wednesday. Oh, this gun is amazing. And where your favorite is the Pokemon Pikachu Joy-Con. Oh, the, the, the Pikachu colored one and the Eevee colored one, like brown, yellowish. Did that come with like some sort of uh, art on it? All right, I just, I cannot fight you. I'm gonna run away. can't see anything. Oh, great. All right. Well, that was fun. I think the bosses are working together now. That's scary. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this gun is like a medium preference for me. I don't know if I really like it that much. One more. Oh, and then the worst gun. Great. And on the final wave. 
And we're down here. Oh, that was like a double kill. I don't think that was by me or anything, but that was cool, whoever did that. Time to run, but also gun. And where you don't like Pokemon Quest? I thought the game was uh, pretty good. It's just being designed as like a mobile app game is not great when it's on a console. It just they should have like kind of done away with that sort of stuff making it so you can't really do everything all at once you have to wait for some sort of reason all right we'll do one more salmon run for tonight which hopefully we could win. Yeah, and we're exactly on Pokemon Quest. There's a cooldown. Because I think it's designed to be like a mobile game. But whenever you have a mobile game on a console, you're supposed to get rid of that. Because usually when you buy a game like that on a console, you buy it with everything already. Like everything unlocked, I guess. Am I reading from Discord? No, the, the YouTube chat. Cindy, you've only seen the green left in uh, pink right Joy-Cons. Oh, the other way around is from Japan. So, like, not easily findable or obtainable. I'm being censored? What does that mean? Like, not the definition, but, like, in what context is this? Who said anything about Pokemon? Do you have top, uh, top chat or live chat or something enabled or disabled? Top chat is enabled. Yeah, that gets rid of uh, some things. Live chat is uh, everything that anyone says in the chat. I see. Or is seen. Which is dumb. The default should have been just the regular free chat. I don't know why they said it. Well, I, I can pretty sure assume why they decided to do that, but like, it's. It's annoying.
And then when you change it, YouTube has that warning. It's like, come on, it's the internet. What do you expect? Oh no, it's getting a little crazy. Please live. Let's get a little crazy over there. That should really just push you, right? Not really damage you. But okay. Oh, we still need quota. That definitely did it. That was a little close. Oh, they're coming from above. Got it. It's a good thing I have a bucket. Yeah, I'm gonna get them. Well, and more, I don't know what should or shouldn't be on a uh, console. I mean, I don't really care, but they should kind of design it to be good for that console. Cola, I'm not. I'm. I have no idea why you're not able to see them. Either blocks or something or other. Yeah, Ku Cola, unfortunately, there's just... I mean, I can't... I can't really do anything about it. Oh, I did get the lab coat. Completely forgot about that.
Ashley, you think your brother got you sick? Hopefully it's not gonna interfere with like <laughs> making exams worse. Alright, didn't forget to do that. But that'll be the uh, end of tonight's stream. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully it was a lot of fun to play and or watch some Splatoon 2 tonight. Uh, where's the schedule? Tomorrow still should be aces. Hopefully. Uh, I think it's going to rain tomorrow. So if there's anything that's going to happen to me being able to not stream it, it would probably happen. But we'll see. Thanks again for stopping by. Have a great night, day, evening, breakfast, lunch, and or dinner.